hello and welcome beautiful people to my youtube channel it is yet another very interesting episode here at okoyot hope farm this is a tree nursery farm that deals with fruits um, trees flowers name it so stay tuned as we take you through the farm jot down what you would like to know and have now, welcome at Okoyo Top Farm. We are located along Kibos Road, next to Lake Basin Rice Mill Complex. We want to show you one, two, three, which we have here. First of all, these ones are croton. Croton are indoor plants. That one is called Bischovia or Bishop Tree. Uh, somewhere there we've got Cypress. Cypress. That comes somewhere here. Those are Cypress. That is one of them. Yeah, we've got Gravelia. Gravelia is good along the fence. The apples. Kai apples. Yeah. Are they flowers? The apples are uh, the ones for fencing. They are thorny flowers. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Kai apples. Kai apples. Okay. Or kayaba. That's right, kayaba. Okay, kayaba in local. Ba Bottle brush. Bottle brush. Yeah. Okay. This is ornamental tree. It blossoms red flowers. A bottle brush. It blossoms white. Those are whistling pine. Also good along the fence. We've got palm tree. This is the variety of palm tree known as royal palm. Uh -huh. Soya soap. Soya soap. Yeah. It's a fruit or is a what? That is a fruit. Uh -huh. It's good for people with a high blood pressure. Okay. Yeah. It produces uh, what seeds it? or the the, the, the what fruit. the fruits. The fruit itself. Okay. Sanchez. Yeah. Okay. That is ornamental flower. Mm -hmm. It blossoms purple. Planted inside or outside? Outside. Okay. It is an out uh, also known as Marobaine. Yeah, a very medicinal herb. Yeah, yeah. So we have the rosemary. Rosemary is also a medicinal plant. You remember rosemary? We used it as repellent to pests and diseases on the benefits of agroecology. This is Malifera. Malifera. Malifera is also good for fencing. It grows faster within a period of six months. Mm -hmm. It's going to cover the whole compound. Okay. Bamboo tree prevents soil erosion. Mm -hmm. Therefore, it is good to be planted along the river banks. Okay. And the swampy areas. And it is also kind of flower. The shade is always it's nice. It's also good for furniture. So you can use the stem mm -hmm. to build something like pub mm -hmm. and the hotels. And decorations. Yeah. For decorations. Okay. Something like that. Fruits. These are grafted mangoes. Grafted mangoes. Yeah. So one goes for about how long? How yeah. much, I mean? One goes for 200 shillings. Mm -hmm. It will take a period of two years mm -hmm. to bear fruits. Okay. Those are grafted oranges. Mm -hmm. A species known as Washington Neville. Washington? Neville. Neville. Yeah. Takes around a period of one to two years. Mm -hmm. It will bear fruits. How much is one? That is 200 per stem. This is the blue gum. Eucalyptus. Eucalyptus. Yeah. Okay. 
eucalyptus there we have I, I, I heard of the South African I don't know what yeah we have got uh, around two species here mm -hmm. this one is the grandis from South Africa Lugan. so what is the difference between the local and the southern and the South Africa yeah the South Africa grows faster here in our place mm -hmm. than the local one so faster by by saying faster like takes how then five years mm -hmm. You can have a grandis mm -hmm. that species from South Africa. Mm -hmm. Whereby this our local will take around uh, ten years. It's very Chefleria. Chefleria. Yeah. So what is chefleria? Chefleria is an indoor plant. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you can also plant it under the ground as a shade. Okay. It doubles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. On that plant we've got golden palm. Golden, golden palm it, uh, is an outdoor plant. Outdoor? Yeah. So... They don't grow tall as the royal palm. They are shorter ones. Okay. And they go for how much each? That one, one goes at 300 shillings. 300? Yeah. How about this one? This one is 200 shillings. Okay. So known as hibiscus. 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 Hibiscus, we've got around three species. Mm -hmm. One that blossom white, mm -hmm. the other one red, mm -hmm. and pink. Plant. Also a medicinal plant. Mm -hmm. They are feta one. Yeah, they are feta one. The mm orange. -hmm. It has been here for now a period of two years. Mm -hmm. And you can see the production. So guys, after seeing these grafted oranges, man, I'm taking one with me and it's very cheap at 200 bob. Well guys, you've seen the different types and the prices. Visit Okoyo Top Farm to pick your taste and yeah. Go away. Yeah. So if I may ask, mm. do you always advise your customers mm. on when to plant like on when to plant and on the ground that they used to plant the their 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 fruits yeah we address them mm -hmm. and how to prepare the all mm -hmm. and when to plant the seeds okay mm. uh, big challenge in this business mm -hmm. is soil soil yeah mm -hmm. cost of around ten thousand shillings to for you soil. to buy a a 14 ton of soil. Another challenge is what? Another thing. So you started with how many seedlings? We started with around 2,000 seedlings of uh, different species. Okay. Yeah. So how have you managed to get here? It is just started one. Right? Whereby they say you pull a tunnel, you save tunnel for the business to prosper. Yeah, so that was it, guys. We've been. That's a coyote up farm. A coyote. Stroke up farm. A coyote, a coyote means it is not easy, but oh. you must live with the hope. <laughs> yeah. That's why it is a coyote up farm. A coyote. Yeah, okay, yeah. so that has been a coyote farm, meaning it has not been easy. So please make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and share to your community.